To understand this mechanism, we first need to look at the coin rejection. Now this sorts by size, which means any coin that cannot stay on the brown and gray railing is rejected into the hole right here. Let's demonstrate that with the biggest coin besides 2 euros, 50 cents, it just falls through the hole. But if we take a 2 euro coin and then pop it in, it rides along these railings into this hole of mechanism goodness. So now that we know how coin rejection works, it's time to talk about the locking mechanism. Now when we turn this, it can't turn either way for two reasons. One, this dark gray piece is in the way of this yellow bar because when we turn this handle, the gear smacks it. And then when we try turning it clockwise, this bar doesn't allow it to. This can never be turned clockwise. When we put in one euro coin, it reaches the bottom and it can't reach that yellow bar. And then this is still locked because this yellow bar is still in the way. When we put in our second coin, it lifts that up we can assume that this yellow bar is going to be lifted up. We turn this, and now this is no longer blocked by the gray piece. And when we rotate this, our toy falls out. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching my newest video. I was wicked excited to get my hands on LEGO Minifigure Series 14, especially with Halloween coming up. And if you feel the same, don't worry. I got your back, my brother. I will be giving away two of these to one lucky winner, and this contest fortunately is international, so you can live anywhere in the world, and I will get this to you somehow. There's two steps to entering this contest. Step one, leave a comment down below. It can say anything you want. I just need to make sure you watch this video. Second of all, make sure to follow me on Google+. If you have a YouTube, Google+, Plus is already linked to it, so make sure to click the first link down below and hit follow or add to circles. This contest ends September 17th Eastern time, which means September 18th, I will go on random.org to randomize the winner and then stock them down to get them their prize. If you would like to see sneak peeks of my creations before they're even on YouTube, make sure to follow me on Toys Amino at Astonishing Studios. This is a new toy social media app that's available on iOS and Android, and it's great for talking to other toy users like us.